Hello and welcome to number 70, College Green in Ennis County Clare. Located just off the Limerick Road immediately opposite St Flannan's College and just a short stroll to Ennis National School and indeed all of the amenities of Ennis Town Centre. Located in this very popular and mature housing development and positioned on a fantastic site that you'll see as the video continues, we are delighted to present this fantastic 4-5 bedroom detached family home. So. Let's take a look at the inside of number 70, College Green. Before we go indoors actually, just to explain this section of the property. So this would have originally been um, probably uh, intended to be a garage, but the owners have very smartly connected it to the main house here to the right hand side via this connecting door or this connecting hallway. And into that space there on the left hand side are two offices ideal for somebody working from home um, and of course even for perhaps a self-contained unit subject to the relevant planning permission but I said I'd explain this before I go in because you'll see a door off the second reception room and it will give you a better feel for the flow of the property both inside and out okay so let's pop in side and take a look so always one of the nicer features of the more mature homes in the town is of course the generous uh, entrance hallways and indeed proportions that were offered when these homes were built. On entering the main entrance hallway, you can see the very generous space that greets you with the carpeted flooring and the carpeted painted rail stairs that leads to the first floor landing. And then off the hallway here to the right hand side is into the first of two ground floor bedrooms. To the left hand side is the main reception. Straight ahead of me is into the kitchen dining with of course the second bedroom and uh, downstairs shower room here on the right hand side. So we'll kind of go with the uh, clockwise uh, flow um, of the ground floor. So here uh, to the left hand side is into the main reception. Again, very nice, bright and spacious room. You have nice bulky furniture in here. So you'll really appreciate the portion of this room more so on your time of view. And of course you have your solid fuel open marble surround fireplace there as well. And again, a nice big bright window here to the left out onto your front gardens. So back into the entrance hallway, and as we continue through, we're into the kitchen dining. Again, very, very well maintained, very nicely presented. You have your oak style built-in wall and base units with your tile splashbacks around, your tile flooring, the space and plumbing for the usual electrical appliances. And then here to the right hand side, you have the integrated fridge freezer. So a very nice overall uh, connecting room from your kitchen dining into the uh, second reception room and of course connecting then into the our outside to your rare gardens which I'll show you later on. But uh, overall a nicely proportioned uh, kitchen dining. Again if you wanted more space there's nothing to stop you doing some work. See here where you perhaps remove this uh, dividing wall uh, and open up uh, this space into uh, more uh, open plan kitchen and dining but of course it's always nice to have that second reception room as well and that's positioned here just off the kitchen diner again with an open fireplace so a nice solid fuel stove in there perhaps really to set um, the coziness of this house off. Now when I was out the front and before I came in I was I mentioned the connection between uh, we'll say the, what we we'll call the garage and the house and this door here straight ahead of me is that door that connects to that connecting hallway and you'll kind of get more of an appreciation for it now. So that door there is this. So this hallway here is that connecting space, that door out onto the front drive. And we won't show it all off, but here straight ahead of me is into two offices and here to the right hand side, a separate WC. So really an ideal space uh, if you need self-contained um, accommodation. Um, or if you're working from home or as a home gym and office combined, it really has enormous potential there. So uh, back into the entrance hallway and we have a second double bedroom here on the ground floor. And again, not nicely proportioned, good quality carpeted flooring and no shortage of built-in units here to the right hand side. The ground floor shower room. Nicely upgraded and this has all the modern touches such as your integrated wash hand basin with the base storage, your mixer tap, your overhead wall mounted mirror unit and lighting, good quality ceiling to floor tiling as well, your heated uh, towel rail and your WC and then you have a wet room style shower tray uh, positioned here 
and again just it's the more modern touch but fine space and very nicely finished with your overhead shower unit as well. And the second bedroom on your ground floor once again a fine double bedroom with the maple style timber flooring again you'll get an appreciation on the size of this on your view but you can see the amount of furnishings in here and yet again we have built-in wardrobes positioned here just behind the door uh, and flush with the wall so you have uh, literally all you have to place into this room is your double bed bedside lockers and you have your unit here to the right hand side so then popping up the stairs and again with it being one of the more mature houses you have a, a fine big landing space and off the landing you have of course access to the additional attic storage you have further storage through a door here on the left and indeed to the right giving you additional storage in the uh in the eaves so you have again no shortage of that throughout the house out to the front we have once again another double bedroom uh, and again you can see the proportions of that and then to the rear of the house almost a mirror image room and once again a double room again so as we pop back out the front of the house you can see we, something i didn't mention at the start you have your entrance porch here but you can see the maturity of the site uh, and the appreciation of what it will be like um, as the seasons go on but you have your nice mature hedgerows mature trees and shrubs that you'll see throughout you have your lawn area here to the front your tarmac adam drive um, that again leads to that adjoining section and then just to stroll around the back for you to really appreciate the amazing site you can see you've nothing here to your left hand side and once again the element the amount of privacy you have is really really good uh, and again look at the amazing garden that you have and again it's because of the mature estate that you're that you find yourself in here in college green uh, you just have that extra space uh, that is sometimes hard to get in the newer homes so if you would like to arrange a viewing of number 70 college green please feel free to call us on 065-684-0200 or email us info at dngosullivanhurley.com. Thank you very much for watching.